What is up guys, this is Tito back with another video on the Redmi K20 Pro and hopefully you guys have already seen the Android 16 flashing guide for the device. Yes, by default the banking apps are not working and by default if you check the pay integrity it will show everything failed and this is because of Google, this is not a ROM's fault or anything. But yes, I will actually try to show you how to actually fix the pay integrity things to get the banking apps working on your Redmi K20 Pro with Android 16. And by the way, the Evolution Storm also received the 9th July 2025 update. And I will also show you how to actually update it to the latest build. If I show you the Android version section right now, this is the 4th July 2025 build. And here the Android version is of course Android 16.2. And obviously if you haven't seen the Android 16 flashing guide on this device, do check it out from the description box below. Right now if I go into the system update section, I can also see the latest build right here. And I have downloaded this specific file. This is the latest 9th July 2025 build of the latest Evolution X ROM. I will talk about the keybox file later on, but let me actually go into the recovery. Here I'll just have to enter my lock screen pin and to update, I just went into my download folder. So for updating, no need to wipe anything, no need to format data or anything. And first file that you will select is the legacy to retrofit zip file, then add to Q and I'll select the latest build. This is the 9th July build on top. And this is the one I'll select and I'll keep this unmount system and vendor selected and I'll also just check the reboot after an installation because I don't need to wipe or format anything after flashing because I am just updating the ROM. So yes, this is how you dirty flash the latest build and right now I'll just swipe to install. And looks like it's automatically rebooting to the system. So let's wait for the time being. And I can see the Evolution Access boot animation. So it has finally booted to the system. So I'll just unlock the device. Shows this cool animation here. Right now in the Android version section, we have the 9th July build right now. So yeah, we have successfully updated to the latest build 9th July 2025 on this Evolution X ROM. And that's how you dirty flash the ROMs. Now let's once again test this play integrity checker without even doing the key box thing. So yes, it still shows everything just failed, like the basic device and strong three integrity stuff is totally failed. It shows cross right here. And if I show you the Play Store about, it shows device is not certified, guys. Let me just click on this fix device certification issue. So yeah, right now it shows could not fix device certification. So right now, let me just talk about it a little bit. Now to fix the Play integrity, this is what you need to do. You go into the Evolver section, you go into the miscellaneous settings and there is the component spoofing, just click on that. There are two options, select Keybox XML and there is the Play Integrity Fix. We need to enable both of those, but first we will have to get a Keybox XML file first. So how do you get that? Well, you can get it from the description box below, I'll put it in the description. Okay, so I have another Keybox that is the Matrix ROMs Keybox. I got it from their support group, I'll also try to link it below in the description. But if you just apply it, make sure whichever key box you apply, do not check with the play integrity API checker multiple times. Just check it once if you would like to. But yeah, do not just do it every time because the key box might get banned. And let me actually show you how to fix it. So go into the download folder, wherever your files are. This is the matrix XML of the key box. I'll select that and it shows XML file loaded. And right now I'll just enable the play integrity fix and it will ask you to restart your device after you enable the play integrity fix and I'll click on OK. And if in the meantime I get a newer or another link of the keybox, I'll link it below in the description. Do not worry. And after doing that keybox thing and with the play integrity fix, the device has been rebooted successfully. And let me actually show you with the play integrity checker right now what it shows. And right now, as you can see, it shows basic integrity device and even the strong integrity is passing. So this is just awesome for the Redmi K20 Pro. Right now, you can actually use banking apps with latest Android 16. And this is on the latest Evolution X build. Let me also show you in Play Store what it shows if the device is certified or not. Yes, it shows play protection certification device is not certified right now. But if you just click on fixed device right now, Let's see what it does. And as you can see, it shows devices check complete. This device is Play Protect certified. So yeah, that's how you will be able to use banking apps on the Redmi K20 Pro with the latest Android 16 Evolution X.
let's just click on got it and right now here it shows device is certified guys and i will request you only one thing that please do not check with this particular key box multiple times in the day if you do that google might just ban this particular key box and you won't be able to use banking apps afterwards and i just checked it just because so that i can show you in this video that it is passing all these three things right out of the box so that you can use the banking apps on your device so i hope this video was actually helpful to you and i will be of course reviewing it later on but for now if you are on the latest evolution x android 16 this is how you get the banking apps working and this is how you can update the rom do share this video with your friends and subscribe to the channel if you have not yet give this video a thumbs up for the algorithm so that many more people can actually see this video thank you so much for watching this video guys hope you all are having an amazing day do consider donating to the channel so that i can keep going with all these videos this is Tito from kd index signing off for today and i'll be catching you guys in the next one bye bye now